For the Huffington Post, I'm Christina Hartman. After a local court ruled his debt collection business illegal, a Saudi man reportedly took to Facebook to make up the losses by trying to sell his son. WKMG explains. Yeah, get this, the asking price, $20 million. Nasser Al-Shari made the online offer after a Saudi court shut down his illegal debt collection company. Al-Shari said he tried to do it to keep himself, his wife, and his daughter from living in poverty. And according to the Daily Mail, Al-Shari had said he was ready and willing to complete the sale procedures in court. Facebook is also unlikely to allow such a sale through its website. According to its Statement of Rights and Responsibilities, users will not post content or take any action on Facebook that infringes or violates someone else's rights or otherwise violates the law. Not to mention, trafficking is an offense in the country, though the U.S. State Department has said it doesn't believe the Saudi government adequately prosecutes offenses. Then again, some aren't buying the proposed sale at all. Apparently, al Shari had appealed for official assistance from the Saudi Labor Office after his business was shut down. That was denied, and RT reports some believe the sale amounts to a sympathy-seeking stunt, and al Shari is merely hoping a rich golf shake might be moved to rescue him from his financial troubles. For the Huffington Post, I'm Christina Hartman.